Brexit Britain's pursuit to join the mammoth CPTPP, Comprehensive and Progressive Agreement for Trans-Pacific Partnership. Trade Group has taken one step closer, Japan's economics minister has said. According to economy minister Yasutoshi Nishimura, the 11-nation group has confirmed it will hold a meeting in the next to discuss the UK's membership. Not only did the minister reveal the timeline of the meeting but he also claimed the UK's membership of the group would be a significant addition. He said on Wednesday, I believe that the importance of Britain as a strategic partner and the expansion of the high-level rules beyond the Asia-Pacific are extremely significant. It was agreed between member countries to hold the meeting in about a month. The UK and Japan signed a trade deal last year as part of Britain's shift towards the Asia-Pacific region. Japan is also the CPTPP's trade chair and will lead the meeting on the UK's membership. The CPTPP is a trade alliance made up of 11 nations and eliminates up to 95% of all tariffs on goods. The CPTPP is also one of the largest free trade areas in the world and accounted for 13% of the world's GDP in 2019. With the UK part of the alliance, it is thought that figure may rise to 16%. While the UK continues with its progress to join the trade alliance, the German economy has struggled to recover due to the supply chain issues caused by the pandemic. The country's automotive industry has been impacted by supply chain issues with BMW, Siemens AG and Volkswagen are all reporting a lack of supply of materials from the most basic wooden pallets to memory chips. Clemens Fuist, president of the Munich-based IFO Institute said, things are actually getting worse rather than better. Thomas Neuernberger, managing director of sales at Mulfingen, Germany-based EBM Pabst, a maker of industrial fans, told Bloomberg, in my career, we haven't had a situation with so many commodities being scarce at the same time, and I've been dealing with the same material since 1996.